All right, what is going on, guys? It is me, like a boss, and I'm gonna do something new today. I'm gonna play some Fallout. Now, I just started off. We're on the very first quest to help Ringo, Ghost Town gunfight, and I already talked to him, and I've already convinced um, Trudy and the uh, Easy Pete. So I am here talking to Chet. Shut up! I don't care. You looking um, to buy some supplies? I need supplies to fight the power drainers. And then he's all like a little bitch. Now just hold and on. he's like, Ugh, I'm not gonna give you the stuff. Then I'm like, let him take over the town. Your business will do really well. Haha, <laughs> I took your armor armor. Your armor you armor, your, your leather armor. Yeah, shut up, Chet. And I've decided to now. be a total dick in this playthrough because I have never brought myself to kill an entire town like Good Springs, but I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna let the power game shoot up as many people as they can, then I'm gonna finish them off just to be a douche. And then I'm gonna loot their town because I can. So let's head up here, get Doc Mitchell. We'll get him to give us some stim packs so when we shoot him, so when we shoot him up, we have stuff to heal ourselves because there will no longer be a town doctor. And I play on um, pussy mode. I do not play hardcore. Just because, I don't know, it's kind of annoying to have to actually find food and crap. Come here, Doc Mitchell. Um, this town, the town is going to be back. attacked by bandits. Anything you can do to help. So, shut up, shut up, don't care. Yes, Seems thank you. Seems like wherever I... Goodbye. And I don't know if you guys knew about this, but in this little t house, uh-oh. If you have a repair of 25, you can repair his submachine gun and take it for yourself. And if you can activate this chemistry set with a science of 25 or greater, you can make some stim packs. And I made five of them, so real easy way. And then, you know, I already looted his whole house in the beginning of the game. Well, you guys were not here and I wasn't recording. But just for the fun of it, I said, hey. I'm gonna play Fallout anyways for my just for fun because I haven't played it in a while, and Skyrim was getting a little boring after you put 100 plus hours into it and do every single quest for every Daedric Prince and find and go cave diving and find all the loot in every single cave and I don't know it just gets boring after a while so I thought I'd just get to the good old New Vegas with some guns. Yes, Sunny's with us. Let's so what's this. going on? Well, yep, I... yep, yep. Oh. Yep, I know. How many are there? At least six. Time to look I'm alive. Go. You better be two. Hey, okay. and just oh, because I plan on taking the whole town out after this, I am just going to let them rush ahead. And... I'm just going to equip my mercenary rifle. And... I'm going to let them take each other out, and then as soon as I feel like it, I'm going to blow them up. And then take what I want off their dead carcasses. So, yeah, it's going to be a good day. A lot of action, a lot of murder. So, we are going to be little... Oh, there they are. There they are. And if you guys didn't know, you can seriously just take off and they do not care. They will continue fighting. And I'm going to hide right here. Uh oh, I'm going to search this dumpster. Uh oh. Shit's going down. Shit's going down. Oh, you have leather reinforced armor, don't you? I think you do. Oh, yeah, you're totally dead, you bastards. That's what I love about this game. It's literally you can kill anyone. Not in like Skyrim where you can't kill someone because it fails a quest. Idolized! Everyone's dead? Well, everyone's super dead now. Dirty <laughs> Sorry, Sunny Smiles. Ringo! Ringo! Ah! Easy Pete! Ow! Easy Pete, stop! Oh, that! There you go. Now blow his freaking head off. 
There you go. Now I'm gonna sleep in one of the beds of the people I murdered. Your health is low, you may want to- Oh, Ringo, you bastard. Wild child! What, you guys don't like me anymore? I'm sorry. Wow. That was actually really, really easy. I expected you guys to put up somewhat of a fight. Caravan deck. Whoa, I don't know why my game does this occasionally. Wow, that's really... Uh, yeah, sometimes it just randomly starts spazzing out when you search someone. Cheyenne, you're freaking dead. Is Doc Mitchell up in the house still? Because he's going to get murdered. I think Chet is still in the store, too. Actually, so I don't have to carry all this stuff around, I'm going to find him. Easy peek. I'm going to have a sexy cowboy hat to put on now. Yes, shut up. I know how to heal an injury if I really, really want to. Leather armor. That's me. Perfect. Good. Good. We have a nice revolver. We got some environment rifles. And we haven't even searched the powder gangers yet. They didn't even make it, like, friggin' hardly anywhere. So, yep. But, whew, excuse me. Yeah, they did not make it far at all. Which is pretty good for the whole... And we're going to be douchebags. And... Take everything. But hopefully... I, um, just so you guys know, I'm going to make a little series out of this. Get this going on my channel. Just because I can and Fallout is amazing. And here's to, here's to hoping to that Fallout 4 will be announced soon. Eventually. Maybe. I don't know. But I would love to see Fallout 4. And I don't know... And, you know, there's always wars going on about where Fallout 4 should take place. I don't know. I don't know, guys. I think it'd be really cool to run around New York City in Fallout mode. Oh, yeah. Nothing sexier than hobbling around with a pistol in your hand with a cowboy hat. But yeah, I'm hoping Fallout 4 will be somewhere cool. I, you know, a lot of people are like, oh, we can't have it in Asia. Asia's stupid. I don't want to watch Fallout in Asia. That wouldn't be cool. Are, do you care that I, didn't, I murdered half your... Actually, before I kill you. They don't even care. They're just like, oh. That was a hell of a... Oh, you asshole. Now that I'm not liked by the town, he raised all of his prices. He's like, fuck you, man. You, you murdered a whole bunch of people in town. I don't like you anymore. Well, that's your problem, Chet, because you just signed your death warrant. Actually, let me sell you a whole bunch of my stuff. You know that. Oh, you only have eight caps? Well, screw you, buddy. I have to freaking barter. <sighs> All right, take that and take that and ooh, ooh, asshole. Actually, I need to shove all by the shovel because if you guys didn't know, you can and I'll buy a pre-war hat. I know as soon as I buy something else, it's gonna like shoot. Art. Really, I can have enough money for a whole stim pack? A whole other stim pack? Alright, fine. Take 67 caps. Shut up. No, I don't want to talk to you anymore. Okay. Now I'm really low on health, and if I get killed by this asshole. What do you think you're doing? I don't know, chat. Oh, shit. What the 
Settler outfit. I'll take a carton of cigarettes and I will take your silence 22. You lost karma. You cannot sleep in an owned bed. Well, fuck you guys. No, this is like the most whole oh, sensor, sensor module. Gotta grab that because eventually we gotta get um, Eddie going. Little robot guy up in Prim, I think is the town he's in. I don't remember. But now we gotta head on up to Doc Mitchell's house and freaking blow his brains all across the room. Just because we can. <gasps> Come on. Come on. Go. You can make it. Ugh. Ugh. Crawl. Hobble. I'm kind of nervous because I don't want to. You just like, hey. Oh, I don't know how I missed. They bought you an extra couple seconds of life. You deserve the grenade rifle. That's what you get for looking through my stuff, you asshole. Think I didn't care. Ha! Ah, gotta level up from it! Well, look at that. I'm gonna take my medicine up a little bit. Well, not that much. Take my survival up to 25 and take uh, lock picking up a little bit because you gotta be able to pick them locks can I sleep in this bed now and feel up no asshole how can someone own a bed if they're dead and in the other room all torn apart in a hundred pieces I think I already, I already looted his whole house pretty sure I did Oh, he has good water. I wish there was like a way that you could select how much water you want to drink and you could just fill up your whole health. That would be nice. Well, let's equip the good old 9mm pistol. And get the hell out of here. Wait, I have to go and I'm going to end the episode by breaking into the little children's schoolhouse and molesting a few of them. Nope. I'm just joking. I'm going to head over to the schoolhouse and kill all the little mantises in there and pick that lock and get all the nice stuff in there. Ah. Hobble! Hobble! I think that you can sleep in the house. Well, I know that there's at least some of those little... Um, some of those little Oh Jesus. Ah. I know there's at least a couple of those little um what are they little trailers? Asshole. Mmm, wait. Stop it. Alright. You're crippled. Well, thanks for being me. Alright. I'm always a Jew, and yes, I know. Caverns. Um, contain? I don't even this close. Cohorts? That's not close. Cutting? I don't think that's even. Camping? No. Consume? No. Conduct? No. Command? No. Ranking? I don't... Cousins? No, it doesn't have three. 
Pump pan? No. I'm just gonna go contain. Maybe crazies? Contain? Uh oh. No! Nope, alright. Screw it. I'm locked out. I am locked out, yeah, yeah. Alright. So we'll just go to the good old lock picking. And thank you, Bethesda, for never changing it since Oblivion. Ah, oh, you asshole. I gotta say, lockpicking in Fallout New Vegas is a lot easier than lockpicking in any of their other games. Like, freaking Oblivion, I sucked balls at it. I ended up just running, getting the skeleton key once I was level 10, and just spamming that auto attempt until it worked. So that's how I got through block picking in Oblivion. So, bam bam. We'll loot this place out. And that's going to do it for this episode. What I'll probably do is in my free time, I'll get on to... What's the town's name? Prim, isn't it? In Prim where I go next? Oh, and just so you guys know, I have all of the DLC stuff except for the casino one. The Sierra Madre one. Just because that... Doesn't really look fun, in all honesty. Never really wanted to play it. So I'm gonna head to Prim. Actually, I may ha head to the Mojave Outpost to get there, get that um, good rifle going, and then we'll just friggin' head on up to uh, New Vegas and shoot up the Strip. Just because apparently I'm gonna be an asshole the whole time. And that's what assholes do. They walk into crowded places and they start shooting. And that's the kind of guy we're going to be. And eventually we're going to go and join Caesar's Legion. And I have honestly never gone and done all of the Caesar's Legion um, missions. I started his quest line, done a couple, but then I always end up getting angry at Caesar because he says it's because he's a dick to you. And I usually end up pulling out a power fist and punching his head off. Get out of my way, Victor. What? Oh! Oh! Alright, dude! Alright, dude! Oh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, let's get that. Alright, let's get that. Yeah! I can take care of myself if you're not freaking shooting at me, you dick. I don't even get you get through your own freaking door. You're twice the size of it. You asshole shooting. There we go. I can sleep in here. Now, Victor, I'm going to head outside and I'm freaking murdering your ass. Just because now, guess what? I'm not a little pussy anymore. I murdered. I said I was going to murder the town, but that includes you. And today we will... Oh, Victor, I really hope you're... Mm. Next stop, Boot Hill. Next stop, Boot Hill. Oh, that's freaking great. Shut up, Victor. Go ahead, shoot me. Mmm. Victor. That's not a dick, asshole. Yes, normally when I play through the game, I end up becoming the ruler of the strip and freaking owning everyone and killing Mr. House. I'll have to kill Hogs anyway, but it's always fun to hit, flip the switch and watch him freaking light up like a freaking piece of bacon. So that is it for this town. One ghost town created. Let's see how many we can make. But I'm going to get out of here. Thanks for stopping by. It was fun. I had fun. My character's name is Bulls, if you guys were wondering. And that's going to do it for this episode. Peace out, stay sexy, and I love you.